livestock diversity is needed in order to adapt to the changing um, production situations to climate change, to changing consumer demands and so on. So livestock breeding is needed to actually adapt the resources to the environment, the changing environment. And this is impor extremely important for the rural livelihoods to produce with adapted genetic resources. There are a number of threats. I just would like to single out one extremely important one, and that is uncontrolled importation of exotic uh, breeds. Um, they are considered uh, to be more profitable uh, because they produce higher outputs like meat and milk and eggs. But on the other hand, they need also higher inputs, um, like more feed, higher quality of feed. It is far more risky to produce with these exotic animals uh, because they may suffer more often local diseases, they may even die, and they may not be able to produce regular offspring because of droughts and so on. So the production is far more riskier for the farmer. The biggest risk is that we lose our livestock breeds that we have developed over the last 10,000 years which may be adapted, extremely well adapted to the local conditions, to extreme climates, um, animal diseases which might be killing, um, or produce specific products or provide specific services. A very practical example where conservation efforts are needed is the most extreme breed that we know are the Yakutian cattle, which are adapted to even minus 60 degrees outside. So these cattle can live outside and can even feed on frozen grass when we have minus 60 degrees, which is more or less the lowest temperature on Earth where humankind can live. If we would lose this population and it's extremely small, we wouldn't have any means to, pr to produce under such conditions meat and milk. Here we need to distinguish sustainable use now uh, and conservation and in the future. And when we talk about conservation now, we may talk about gene banks. For the purpose of this report, a hundred countries reported to FAO that they either established gene banks to store frozen semen of their local breeds or are in the process of establishing such gene banks.